All right there everyone, today I'm going to be playing this game, I Ain't Got No Body, which um, the artwork on there is kind of cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Very spooky. I was attracted to this because uh, it's a Tinesoft game. Oh, it's, well, it's really, it says, manufactured under license by St from Strobe by Tinesoft. And um, I just like the spooky theme of it. I live in Tyne and Weir and I'm kind of attracted to Tinesoft games, even though they've got a reputation for not being very good. And also I kind of like horror games, so I always like to get something if it's got like a bit of a spooky theme to it. Poor Harry has had a nasty accident with a chainsaw and now finds himself in three pieces. You have to find, find the three segments, take them to the spirit over the grave to resurrect him. Yes, I've never found any of the body pieces. I've had a few goes on it. Let's, um, I've got the tape loaded up. Let's have a go. No music or anything to speak of. There's, um, I think there's a beep when you get killed and that's about it. <laughs> Maybe something when you pick up a collectible, I don't know. But um, yeah, there's also a screen editor which I haven't played around with, but. So yeah, here you go, I'm this little ghost. And I kind of like the way you can just float around. He moves slow when he's on the ground as if he's walking. These pink things are like energy orbs. When you're flying around, you can see your aura is going down and then when you pick them up, that tops it up. Oh. And you've got to try and fly around and then this in here you'll see this bloody thing flies right at you you've got to i can never get out of its way god damn it there we go we escaped so what i picked up there was one of them blue crystal things and oh shit and that um that, that makes me so i can go through these blue doors um, yeah, I haven't found a whole lot to be honest. There's a green one there, and um, yeah, it's it's not the most amazing, innovative game I've ever played, but it's still strangely fun. I was expecting a complete pile of rubbish from Tinesoft because they've got the reputation, but I find this quite enjoyable in a way. Perfectly serviceable. The thing with this game, they've got A and Z is up and down instead of Q and A. So half the time I'm pressing A thinking I'm going to go down or up. See this room, I don't know what it is, but it kills you. I just die. I don't know what it is. Just hang around a bit and then you're dead. So I just stay out of that room. I don't know what I don't know what the deal is. Um, this room I can't really do anything with. So, yeah, I guess I'm stuck. I'll have to go back the way I came. Oh. Let's go this way. So I kind of like the exploration-ness of it. Oh. So this here is a doorway. Um, right. Let's get some more energy. So yeah, I haven't found any of the body parts yet that I need. What's through here? Whoop! Certain death, by the looks of it. Hmm. Whoop! Okay, that didn't kill me that time. Okay, so here's a room of... See, I don't know what these fires and things do. They see, everything just seems to kill you in this game. I think that's pretty much the rule. You want to know what something does, it kills you. What? Ah! Oh. All right, see, I'm not very, I'm not very good. Let's try again. All right, here's another room of certain doom. Can't go that way, there's a door. Oh, oh, come on, you, you just have to slightly glance against things and they kill you. you gotta be very accurate. And these, these things are just unfairly fast. Ugh. 
frustrating. That's what I'd call this game. Whoop. Right, what's through here? A doorway. Okay, I thought I couldn't pass through there then for a second. Ah. Oh. Sometimes I don't know how close I can go to things. Right, let's... Uh... Oh! Yeah, I like exploring this weird castle. It's not the most groundbreaking thing, like I said, but it's 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 kind of weird. It's kind of weird and enjoyable. I don't know why. I don't know why I like it, but I do. There we go. Right, I can't get any of these. Ah! Don't get me, please. I've got the pink. Okay, there's a pink crystal there, which it doesn't seem to want to let me pick up. Why not? Oh, hey, come on. Okay, I don't know what happened there. It just didn't want me to pick up the pink crystal. Maybe I've got to pick up one in a certain order or something. I don't know. Oh, let's go again. Let's go again. I don't think I've ever been over here. I think maybe sometimes I run out of aura and I don't realise, but there's other times where certain screen... Oh, God damn you. <gasps> See that orb there? How do I get that? I can't. Wait, where am I? Oh! And this guy, what... How the, how the hell do I get past him? There's no way. Come on, man. Ah, oh, it's just, it's just impossible. But it makes me want another go. Come on, let's do this. Oh shit, I messed up. Ow! Oh! Wait, there's another way out of there, isn't there? Okay, there's these guys. Okay, can't go that way. Come on. Ridiculous. And why do Crucifixes kill me? Am I, am I meant to be a Satanist? Ugh. Honest to God, this game is. I'm sure, it's just designed to annoy you as much as humanly possible. I could potentially just get one of the pieces of body straight away. Ah, it's so confusing sometimes the controls. So, oh. whoa, Nelly. How are you meant to get past this guy? He's such an awful person. Is that my legs? I don't know. That looks like my legs. Oh. Okay, fine. Fine, well, we won't get them. I don't know what I'm doing now. Let's try down here. Whoa, there's two of them. Well, there's two of them now. And there's that to instantly kill me. Oh. oh, good. Oh, good. The jellyfish get me. Fuck, how are you meant to get past that? Ah. Okay, this game is just... Yeah, it's, it's madly infuriating, to be honest. It doesn't seem too fair. 
and there's some bits where I, I seem to be able to find the object and then it's like I don't know whether it's just weird it's not letting me pick me pick it up for some reason oh I went up instead of down again because a is usually down on a lot of games and this time it's uh, just if I can just remain calm we'll be all right so all I need to do is remain calm really but yeah I kind of like this exploration element to the game I think uh could be better executed. The graphics could be a bit nicer, but it's really got its own little charm to it, I think. What's up here? Oh, a ghost. That's a surprise. Nope. Let's keep looking. Let's keep looking. Why am I dead? Oh, energy. Okay, here's a room. Some description. Here's another room. Why do the bells kill you? I don't understand that. Okay, I think I don't think I can go anywhere in that room anyway, can I? No, because I need a red key. And up here Oh no I'm stuck, what the hell? I didn't think this through. You see, now I'm stuck here and I can't run down my energy because I'm on the floor. I can't get hit by any enemies, so... Uh, hmm. Okay, guys, I think I'm going to end the game here because uh, uh, as far as I can tell, there's actually no way to... Uh, I And there might be some way with the spectrum that I just don't know about. But as far as I can tell here, I'm completely stuck without resetting the system and loading it up again. And do I want to sit through the entire loading screen, loading time again, when I feel like it's the game's fault that I'm stuck rather than my own? I mean, I could have thought ahead and got, oh, I would have got stuck there, but, you know, in the heat of the moment, sometimes you don't. And now, like, what? I've, I've, I've soft-locked it. Okay, so that was uh, I Ain't Got Nobody. I don't know whether to recommend it. I find it quite charming. I like the graphics. I think they're really colourful. I kind of like the theme and the uh, the floating aroundness of it, but uh, it's got a lot of problems. <laughs> it's it's a bit rough around the edges, but um, yeah, I don't know. I kind of I kind of enjoy it. I wanted to make a video of it because I I don't know how to feel about it. It's kind of enjoyable and. Uh, also, a problem I'm having is I'm seeing things I can pick up, like the crystals, and I'm sure I found my legs, which are supposed to go here. But flying on them doesn't seem to work. It doesn't seem to pick them up, so I don't know what the deal is there. There's nothing in the instructions that tell me I have to get things in a certain order or what. So it's a mystery. But I, I guess I'll figure it out one day. Anyway, cheers for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. I ain't got nobody. And, uh, all right, catch you next time. Bye.